travelers out there. Uh, Kathy and I have been spending some time in Andersonville. We did the walking tour. Uh, we uh, brought to you a video about the Drummer Boy Museum. And in this one, we do a drive-through of some of the residential areas of Andersonville. Hope you enjoy the video. We ask that you subscribe to our channel. We <clears throat> hope that you will leave us a comment. Uh, we hope that you'll give us that thumbs up. Uh, that's a like, and YouTube uh, uses that interaction to help promote our channel. Uh, share this video with other travelers that might like to know something about Andersonville. And have a blessed day. If you're going north on Georgia 49 from America's Georgia, this is what you will see as you approach the turn off to go into the village of, of Andersonville. If you're headed south on Georgia 49, coming from Montezuma, Georgia, uh, this is what you'll see as you approach where we turn to go into the Andersonville Village.
place you're talking about an inn. That's a city hall, I think. Huh? Right. Well, honey, we've done our walk for the day. Hey, yeah. if you wanted a Coca Cola, you can't even, can't even get no Coca Cola. No, but if you want one, I got one. Yeah, yeah, you do, don't you? I'm gonna have to get me one, drink me some crackers in a minute. But I yeah. saw on that sign, did they have bingo up here or something? Uh, I'm like to say that. Yeah. Center's up and thirsty for bingo, 60 to 80. You think that's for real? Well, it's on the sign, huh? Yeah. Well, that place right there looks all clean, but yeah. he said, the, who, what'd she tell you, the guy that bought it? Doesn't open it very much? No. This little yellow house was built in 1910. Has 980 square feet. It three, has three bedrooms and one bath. That's crazy, isn't it? Some houses, honey. Mm -hmm. Oh, you got it going? Yes. Okay. I've preached in that little church before. Oh, really? Yeah, it's a Methodist church. Oh, okay. Is it still? I yeah, as far still... as I know. Front of it looks nice, freshly yeah. painted door. Yeah, you said something about that house. Yeah. Yeah, I said that's where someone I know lives. Look at this big old white house across the road, honey. I guess he's talking about all that empty space. Yeah. This impressive house is 3,540 square feet. It has five bedrooms, two baths. It has fire, five fireplaces and it was built in 1920. Yeah. It's over there. Yeah. Now that's, um, well, I know it used to be a nice house. I don't Looks <laughs> like it should be. This house built in 1910 has 1,764 square feet and three bedrooms and two baths. I mean, there are some nice homes over yeah. here. That one is grown up, honey. I guess it's abandoned. See, like that one looks yeah. like somebody's painted yeah. that one. They kept it up. There's a little apartment place looks like back there. I'll see if I can find out what year these were built. Now that one probably is 20, 1920s or before. Mm -hmm. What's this called? Anderson Street. This is Anderson Street. Yes. Okay. It's just like everywhere else. Some people just can't afford to keep them up. Yeah. And yeah, that's what the lady at the museum said. We were talking about houses. She said, you know, people, people just don't have the money to keep them up. It's a nice house across the road, straight in the pine thicket over there, honey. This one, I think you go that way. I think you can go left to go back in there. I don't know. I've never been back in there. I just know about that road down yonder. Yeah. Seems like I have been around the block. Yeah, those glasses are rattling back there, honey. What glasses? The ones I put in the back seat. Uh. But it's all right. People hadn't heard a rattle before, they wouldn't know what it is. Mm -hmm. Somebody's sitting outside right there. Yeah, it's a nice day. 76 degrees according to the thing in the truck. Mm -hmm. I've always, if that's dirt down there, I don't go down there. I've just always. No, it's I paved. I thought it was huh? paved. It is paved. Huh? I've just never been way back in that way. We're not going to go very far down in there, honey. Just to see what's down here. There ain't nothing but a feel over there, is it? Not That's much, the way it looks. Not much down this way, is it? Mm -hmm. I thought there was houses somewhere. Maybe it's on that other. There's another street over that way. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Uh oh. What's this gonna be? Dirt? Yeah. 
Uh-uh. We're gonna turn around. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, railroad track was down that way. When you get back down where you came from, turn to the right this time. Let's just go way on down that road. Uh -huh. You know, where you would have turned left, but we took a right. I thought it was something down this road, but I see it's not. I don't think there's a whole lot down that way either, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, then we just came out this road. We'll yeah. ride back down it. Huh? Just go straight and let's see where it goes. Where it goes. Let's see what's going on in this place. They got some nice homes here, honey. Now it's a mobile home, but it's still nice. Mm-hmm. Looks like it's trying to clean up that yard now. Yeah. That looks bad, don't it? Yeah, it needs cleaning. <laughs> that is. I thought they were waving. That's an odd-looking house. piece of siding or I buy a side of bacon, honey. It's well, some of these that are just wood, you know, it doesn't cost that much to get the bottle of Clorox and just spray it. It would help a lot of it. But, you know, like I said, some people can't. Like you said, they're doing anything. the best they can, I assume. A lot of these little towns. Are, and they could go rub it. Just, uh, just withering away, honey. You know, when the older generation passes on, I, I have a feeling that they're just going to dry up all together. There's nothing here to keep the younger people. And, uh, so they just, uh, they just move on. They really can't do anything here because there's not anything. Unless they work at that plant, what is it? I yeah. guess that was that street down here. I was this thinking one on the about. Left. Yeah. Is that isn't that paved? Yeah. What's wrong? What's going down? Cyanide. Down there. Down here. That's the name of a chemical company, honey. Mm-hmm. Well, this is a dead end, honey. Oh. Lot for sale. It's not a bad looking house there, honey. A little ranch. No. This one's abandoned up here. It's falling down. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to turn around right here, honey. I didn't know it was a dead end, honey. I thought there was, might have been some recent Like I said, the Andersonville is very big, so it don't take long to get out of town. Mm -mm. Can you back up? I mean, yeah. I'm just taking my time. Oh, we don't fall in a hole. I hope so, too. Actually, something over there. What is that, a garage or something? Yeah, it looks like that. like the garage, honey. Some kind of shed down that dirt yeah. driveway. Yeah. But that's about it, honey. Yeah. 